Hi, Duty Addicts. I am home temporarily um, to pick up some stuff. I found a couple of places in the floor that to me didn't finish even during the time when the floors were being refinished. We had rain here in Georgia, the weather, the temperature changed and it got really cool. Um, so it took a little bit longer for the floors to set so it didn't cure evenly. So they're gonna have to redo them. So they're gonna start on Thursday and hopefully I'll be able to get back in the house sometime this weekend. And I'm past ready to be back in my own bed. This is going on two weeks. So I'm ready to come home. But I wanted to give you a quick update to let you know that I was able to work out things with the seller uh, for that medium uh, tassel bag. She has um, completed a partial refund, which I thought was more um, than fair. That was fair considering I'm gonna have to pay to ship it off to Dooney and then we'll also have to pay for the repair. So I appreciate that and um, feel a lot better about the transaction. Still not happy about the way, of course, the um, the bag broke, but at least at this rate, um, it's not completely out of, out of my pocket, all out of my pocket. So that's where I am. The semester is kicking my butt and I will be extremely happy when this semester is over and I have my degree in my hand and can call law school done. Um, but as much as this is an update, I purchased a couple of items. One of them I already have boxed up to take uh, to ship back. But I wanted to share this bag with you because all of your reviews and unboxings and pictures and comments um, made me decide that I had to have this bag in my collection. So I want to share that with you really quickly. So there she is, my Dooney and Burke camo drawstring bag. Um, I'll try to annotate the name of the subscriber that sent me a note uh, or posted a message letting me know that the bags were back on sale and that there was no promo code needed because I immediately went over to check to make sure that this bag was still available and it was. Um, so this is regular $318. And I believe I paid $64 for it. I've already packed the receipt back up because the other bag that I'm shipping back. But I have uh, all three now. I was able to get now the drawstring bag, the fill bag, and then the dome satchel bag. So I think I have got enough ducks uh, to represent or rep the duck. Is that what Ivana says? So thank you ladies so very much for going on this journey with me. I can't hardly believe that it's February 1. Um, I would love to say that it's May 1 because then I'd be a week out from graduation. But um, the house is still in shambles and they allowed me one more time to run in before they start back on the floors uh, to pick up some items which is great because I travel tomorrow um, and then the rest of the week for work. So I needed something to kind of lift my spirits because between work and school and the house and turning down the job offer, but the energy that it took to negotiate to a point where I said, you know, this doesn't make sense. The timing of it is not right for me. My mom's been having um, some health issues and I'm a couple hours away from her. So that has um, created some issues and then just life, you know, just other things kind of going on. I mean, God is good. He is amazing. He is blessing me beyond belief. And it's hard to believe that I've got so much going on in so little time already this year. Um, so I don't want you to think that I'm going through bad things. It's not. I just feel him stretching me and preparing me 
for so many other things. And just when I think that I can't, you know, handle anymore between work and school and the house, um, he shows me every day that I have yet to see what I am truly made of from a strength standpoint. So for those of you that the year has started off rough, I want to encourage you to just stay put, stay the course because trouble won't last all ways. And if you can just push past these few uncomfortable moments, there will be greater things, greater, happier things on the other side of whatever you are going through. But to help me get through, I had to go get me a duck. So y'all, thank you so very much for watching. Until next time, I do hope that you're finding something to feed your Dooney addiction. Take care.